Now I'll show you how nitrogen expands rapidly. See, we pour the nitrogen into the barrel. See how it's smoking? In fact, this is not nitrogen. This is the moisture surrounding it. It freezes and becomes water vapor. It condenses. Now we will evaporate the entire, entire liquid nitrogen, which is in the barrel with the help of boiling water. Well, on the count of three, come on. One, two, three. That's just to understand that the nitrogen has evaporated and rather quickly. If we use nitrogen as a propellant charge, then our task is to make it expand as fast as possible. Well, yes, so that it gets to a large volume. And now we'll see how the bottle acts if you leave a little bit of liquid nitrogen in it. The bottle turns into a real bomb because when nitrogen becomes gaseous, it expands 700 times and the bottle can't withstand such pressure, so sooner or later, it will explode. Okay, we've made halfway. Now let's go to the place where we'll blow it up, and we'll close it there at the same place, right? Sure, if we screw it on now, then I can't tell for sure when it'll explode, so we better shut it and go away. It may take one second or five minutes. You can't be certain about it. Well, we'll blow it up somewhere here, right? Yes, put the light right here. Close it and run away. Yeah, and we leave this way. Well, is it generally a safe distance where we're standing now? Yeah, it's quite safe. That is, it will burst into pieces, but at that distance, they will not fly at us so fast. And even if they hit us, they will not do us no harm. Just bounce off. Well, that's good for you. You're wearing glasses. I should have given you a pair too. Is it just me or is the upper part getting inflated? I think I've lost the argument. It was good, but it was cool, yes? Look. Is this the place where the bottle stood by any chance? I guess so. A small hand grenade. That is, by looking at this stone floor, you can imagine what would happen to our gun. And frankly, at that moment, I wouldn't want to hold it in my hands. Naturally, we'll fix it somehow, I suppose.